Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Erica with Memory Box Candle Co. And I make videos all about the journey of starting a candle business. And in today's video, we are gonna be answering the question, which one is better, candles or wax melts? And I'm going to be diving into this topic, talking about uh, the differences in making them and the differences in selling them. So when it comes to the actual differences between them, really, the only difference because they're both scented wax with the same purpose of um, being able to have fragrance in the air, throw the fragrance in the air um, and have people enjoy the scent. So that's really just kind of the basics of the differences between the two of them. Um, but the difference of course is that for candles, they have wicks in them. So the wick is what is going to contribute to adding heat to the scented wax and is going to throw that fragrance into the air versus with a wax melt, you need a device like an electric wax warmer to be able to heat up that scented wax melt cube. And then at that point, the fragrance will be thrown into the air. So there is just basically a difference in terms of um, how the process of that fragrance gets thrown into the air. But overall, um, the process of creating them is really just a matter of blending wax with fragrance in order to create the scented wax. But of course, because wax melts don't need wicks in order to have the fragrance be thrown into the air, they are very easy to make. Um, they are way less of a hassle um, and they're just way more simple to make than candles versus a candle that has the wick or the wicks in the candle that needs to go through the testing process. Um, the flame is what is going to be responsible for helping the fragrance get thrown into the air. Um, so in terms of the making process, candles are way more involving. They're way more um, complicated, you could say, um, than wax melts. Wax melts are just like a very simplistic basic form of a candle that doesn't need wicks in order to basically do the same thing. Now, when it comes to selling these two things, there is a difference just because a lot of people don't know what wax melts are or don't know how to use wax melts. Candles are very simplistic for the buyer. It's very easy to just have the candle, you light the wick and you have the fragrance that's gonna get thrown into the air. Versus a wax melt, a lot of times what I've heard is people will say, oh, well, I don't have a wax melter, so I'm not able to get those. Um, which is where if you sell wax melters, that also helps incentivize as well. But it requires a little bit more education, I would say, a little bit more kind of informing the customer on what exactly a wax melt is and that they'll need a separate device in order to use it, um, which is an additional cost if they don't already own one of those and they don't already, you know, constantly or have been familiar with using wax melts in their homes. So that's something that uh, a lot of times I've ran into specifically at markets of people, you know, not knowing exactly what it is or not having a wax melter and that they're more interested in the candles because it's more simple for them to not have to have anything else that they need to purchase in order to use it. So overall, I wouldn't say that one is necessarily better than the other. I have a lot of customers that prefer one or the other or both. It really just depends on the customer, but it does give your customers options. So I like to have both because it gives options and also because I don't know if I could ever get rid of wax melts. They are just so easy to make, so quick to make. Um, I love making and selling wax melts. Um, I feel like I've said this before, but from the beginning, I'm like, man, I get jealous when I hear that people are just wax melt company people and that's all that they do because it's just so simple and easy. Um, but of course, candles, they just have, you know, a special place in my heart and I just could never not have candles. But um, overall, those are the main differences between them. Um, I feel like they complement each other more than anything. So if you have a candle business and you've been thinking about adding wax melts on, um, I recommend to give it a try and see how it does. Um, I personally, again, think that wax melts are just so great to add on. They're just a great compliment um, and they give your buyers just kind of more options from you and your business. Um, but with that, I am going to end today's video right here. If you enjoyed today's
today's video, make sure to leave it a big thumbs up as well as subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Also, don't forget to follow me over on Instagram at Memory Box Candle Co. And I will see you in my next video.